Okay, we're going to talk about the SWPP3 training along with the Stormwater Pollution Prevention Plan. Um, this first part is recorded to save my voice. Okay. Basically, the state of Georgia issued a new permit, and it's essentially a general permit and its authorization to discharge under the National Pollution Discharge Elimination System. Uh, basically, stormwater discharges associated with industrial activity. The permit went into effect June 1st, 2012, and it's effective until May 31st, 2017. The permit contents, this is uh, taken from the uh, table of content and I've, it's a 131 page document so I've kind of uh, broken it down into the important components of what applies to us, what you need to know. The first part of the permit talks about the coverage under the permit and you all will have access to the actual permit language on the shared drive. Second part is the control measures and effluent limits. We do not have any effluent limits for our industrial code. Third section is on corrective action. Talks about inspections. There are going to be some inspection requirements, routine facility inspection, as well as quarterly and annual benchmark monitoring which is new. Stormwater Pollution Prevention Plan, there's details on what must be included in the SWPPP. It discusses monitoring requirements, reporting and record keeping, and the sector specific requirement and we do have a benchmark monitoring as I mentioned before as part of our sector specific requirements that we will get into. Let's just go through some basic definitions. NOI means notice of intent. NPDES is the National Pollution Discharge Elimination System. The outfall is the location where stormwater in a discernible, confined, and discrete conveyance leaves a facility or site, or if there is a receiving water on site, becomes a point source discharging into that receiving water. Obviously, the permittee is the entity that submitted an NOI. Point source is important. I'm going to talk about point source. It's any discernible, confined, and discrete conveyance, including but not limited to any pipe, ditch, channel, tunnel, conduit, well, discrete fissure, container, rolling stock, concentrated animal feeding operation, landfill, leachate collection system, vessel, other floating craft from which pollutants are or may be discharged. This term does not include return flow from irrigated agriculture or agricultural stormwater runoffs. More on uh, definition. Primary industrial activity includes any activity performed on site which are identified by the facility's, <coughs> excuse me, the facility's primary SIC code. And basically the permit uh, has different SIC codes based on the different industries. A significant spill is um, includes oil releases or hazardous substance in excess of the reportable quantities of the and those quantities are listed in section 311 of the Clean Water Act. Stormwater is essentially any stormwater runoff, snow melt runoff, surface runoff, and drainage. Stormwater discharge associated with industrial activity is essentially the discharge from any conveyances which is used for collecting or conveying stormwater that is directly related to manufacturing, 
processing or raw material storage areas at an industrial plant. So that's basically everything that rainwater touches. Stormwater discharges from industrial yards, immediate access roads, rail lines used or traveled by carriers of raw materials, manufactured products, waste material, or byproducts used or created by the facility, material handling site. Notice it also includes uh, sites used for residual treatment, storage or disposal, shipping, and receiving areas manufacturing buildings, storage areas, including tank farms for raw materials and intermediate as well as the uh, finished product. And areas where industrial activity has taken place in the past and significant materials remain and are exposed to storm water. Again, as I said, anything exposed to storm water, anything the rain water touches. <laughs> We're now going to talk about NOI submittal access through the share drive and if everyone has access to the share drive. <clears throat> 